Welcome back. In this lecture, we will look at the basics of power electronics on electric cars. First, we will look at what is power electronic converter. Then we will look at the different converter types based on whether the power is AC or DC, direction of power flow, and the presence of isolation. A power electronic converter is an electronic device made of high power semiconductor switches that uses different switching states to change the magnitude and waveform of the voltage and current between the input and output. A semiconductor switch is the basic building block of any power electronic converter. We can see the schematic representation and the real photo of semiconductor switch. In this case, it is an isolated gate bipolar transistor, or called IGBT in short. These power electronic switches are able to turn on and off at high switching frequencies ranging from hundreds hertz up to hundreds of kilohertz. In other words, they are able to turn on and off within half microsecond. The new silicon carbide or gallium nitride based switches turn on and off even faster within tens of nanoseconds. In this particular IGBT switch, an antiparallel diode is included that allows reverse currents. The other commonly used semiconductor devices in power converters are metal oxide semiconductor, field effect transistor or MOSFET as they are commonly called, and thyristors. The most common way to classify power converters is based on whether the input and output is EC or DC, that is if it is alternating current or is direct current. Based on this classification we can have four types of power converters, namely a DC to DC converter, a DC to AC converter which is commonly called an inverter, an AC to DC converter which is commonly called a rectifier and AC to AC converter. For example, a DC to AC converter converts power from input DC source to an output AC load. The second way to classify converters is based on if they are facilities unidirectional or bidirectional power flow. Typically, unidirectional converters use diodes at the output in order to allow power flow in one direction only. In case of bidirectional power converters, semiconductor switches like MOSFETs or IGBTs are used both on input and output sides. A third way to classify converters is based on whether there is transformer isolation between input and output. Isolation in power converters is primarily required for safety reasons. For example, all mobile phone chargers are isolated so that the 5 volt low voltage output is safe to touch even though the input is from 110 volt or 230 volt AC. Further, the transformer used for galvanic isolation can have a different turn ratio between input and output that can help in stepping up or stepping down the voltage. This table gives you an overview of the three simple ways to classify power converters based on AC or DC power, power flow direction and presence of isolation. Different types of power converters can be developed that meet combination of these characteristics. With this knowledge, we can look at the four main power converters in electric car namely onboard charger, the traction battery converter, the auxiliary battery converter and the motor drive in electric car uses a central DC bus called high voltage bus in the figure for exchanging power between various electric components and the converters are responsible for controlling the power flows. The onboard charger is responsible for converting AC power from the grid to central DC bus for charging the traction batteries. Hence it is AC to DC power converter. The battery converter then controls the charging or discharging of the traction batteries by either drawing or feeding power from high voltage bus. Hence battery converter is bidirectional DC DC converter. Similarly, the auxiliary battery converter is used to charge the auxiliary battery by drawing power from high voltage DC bus. Finally, the motor drive is DC to AC converter, 
used to control the operate and AC motor. The motor drive is bidirectional and feeds power to the motor for propulsion and acts as the AC to DC rectifier by drawing power from the motor during a regenerative break-in. In some cases, the motor drive can be DC to DC converter if the motor is DC motor like brushless DC motor. To wrap up, we look at what is power electronic converter and how power semiconductor switches play a key role in their operation. We learn about different types of power converters based on AC or DC, isolation and power flow direction. The four key power converters in electric car are the onboard charger, traction, auxiliary battery converter and the motor drive. The motor drive facilitates in controlling the voltage, frequency, phase and current supply to the motor resulting in four quadrant operation.